first see police officers inside an unmarked vehicle passing through an area. At that very moment, a group of women can be seen running away from something. It turns out they were running away from the police as we see the officers pressure the women by the shop. They seem to be telling the women to get inside the building, but this seemed a bit too harsh. On this video, the officer behind the wheel decided to risk civilian lives with their reckless driving. Amen. The officer was swerving in traffic on one of the busiest roads in South Africa. He's just playing with the indicators. <laughs> I... The officer continued with his circus show and it came to a climax when they damaged another vehicle on the road. <sighs> no way. They were extremely lucky, as this might have turned deadly in seconds. They did not even bother to stop after causing that accident. The officer behind the wheel might have been intoxicated on the job. Yeah. This seems to be a recurring character in this video, as shown on the following clips. The reckless driving continued. The police vehicle kept switching lanes every second, confusing other motorists on the road. Don't you touch that Mercedes, please. <laughs> the following video is even more reckless as the officer could not control his anger. We first see the community arguing with the cop as there seemed to be some sort of a disagreement. The officer comes out of the vehicle holding his firearm. Things were now escalating really quickly. decided to fire his gun on the ground, but his mannerisms reflected more of a gangster than an actual police officer. The man decided to walk away from the situation without arresting anyone at the scene. He might have been the wrong party here since his fellow officers left him to follow the vehicle on foot without assisting the man in any way. In many countries, once an officer discharges a weapon, they have to report why the weapon was discharged and the situation can be assessed if it was necessary to discharge such a deadly weapon. This traffic officer decided to drink on the job. He was now struggling to balance inside the shop while being filmed by these astonished civilians. The man who was supposed to be enforcing traffic rules was now struggling to walk. He definitely does not deserve that uniform. Totally unacceptable. He continued to walk forward towards the chair as he tried to gain his composure. The man was now seated as he tried to understand how he got to this point. Hey. Hello. Oh, anyway guys, um, highlights, 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 now it's time for highlights. Let's go to the first video first. Um, I, I don't know, but I think this was done during the time of uh, the lockdown i don't know if anyone has got you know a, a glimpse of this video if you've watched it before 
please advise us on the comment section below but i think this was done during the covid 19 uh lockdown and yeah man the police were just trying to do their job really i i don't really think or believe that the police were misbehaving in this instance but my only concern is that some police officers were not wearing their masks so that uh also uh, can show that maybe it was after the lockdown issue and maybe they were misbehaving but i think they were just trying to do their job here yeah, to really and it's at night it's late there's no one on the street uh ladies should just, should just go back to safety guys like come on sometimes it's not all the time that the police do misbehave sometimes they do these things just to protect us as civilians because they know better i mean they know what really uh happens on the street so yeah man i i don't really believe that they were misbehaving on this clip and then um this driver this guy was crazy this guy was totally crazy i want you to check what he was doing with his indicators because there was a i mean just in this situation right here he's indicating that he's turning to the right and there's no space on the right like there's no lane on the right so this guy was just playing with indicators really the officer was swerving in traffic on one of the busiest roads in south africa this is totally unacceptable this is totally unacceptable this is government's property this vehicle was supposed to be saving some people, you know, at, at some place uh, right now or during this period. I mean, so someone was supposed to be arrested. In fact, people get arrested each and every day. And so this vehicle was supposed to be doing something pretty much productive and to the benefit of the community. But this guy was just driving recklessly. And I, I am very, very sorry for, for the Ford driver. And uh, the Mercedes, if you saw the C-Class, that guy was also lucky not to get bummed on too. So, yes, man, this is really, really sad. This is the Ford driver. Uh, he was in front of him. I'm sure he changed lanes by the, uh, just by realizing how this guy was driving. The officer continued with his circus show, and it came to a climax when they damaged another vehicle on the road. He changed lanes trying to avoid the police officer, but... The police officer came and bumped him on the side. So, man, this is really, really sad. And then this this guy is super crazy. I don't know what went uh, in his mind, but this guy is crazy. He doesn't really know what the community is capable of. Eh? <laughs> if he's from AKC, he, he should probably know better that um, discharging a firearm like that, you know, on a raged community. With, I mean, this guy was outnumbered. He, he did have he did had a firearm on his uh, with him, but he was outnumbered. And if if maybe something had happened and he lost his firearm, the community was gonna burn him alive. Trust me, <laughs> South African communities are capable of that. So this guy was just lucky to uh, to get away in this situation. And um, kudos also to his partners, those who were working with him. They realized that he was wrong, and then they just tried their best to avoid the situation and evade. Uh, you know that area so yeah kudos to him and then uh mr drunkard i uh, know this one ah <laughs> uh, no man guys come on uh, it's it's during the day it's hot it's sunny he's wearing the uniform and he's already drunk i don't know what should we do with this guy uh, come on uh we once did a video of police officers that were drunk uh you know on their uniform and somewhere during the course of their work they were drunk so he definitely does not deserve a uniform totally doesn't deserve it totally it's just a waste of police uniform and he continued to walk forward towards the chair as he tried to gain his composure anyway guys uh that's it for me today uh thank you so much for watching thanks so much for tuning by you know thank you so much for your attention and if you did enjoy this video please don't forget to hit the like button and if you are new to this channel welcome i appreciate you i appreciate your time hit the subscribe button and the bell button whenever i post another video you get the notification you get to watch the video first from bernard from south africa dream venture reborn to the world Nah. see you next time